Right, here we have the cleaning of the beer line in the beer fridge. Now we have to leave this for 10 minutes and then come back to it and do some more. So we turn it off. And the last 10 minutes we have to flush it through for. And it just run off enough to clear the pipe through. That's probably about it. And then you sit for another 10 minutes and we'll come back to that shortly. And the last 10 minutes we have to flush it through for. And it just run off enough to clear the pipe through. And that's probably about it. And then you sit for another 10 minutes and we'll come back to that shortly. So here we are last time. We'll flush out all the cleaning fluid this time. We've had three 10 minute uh, sessions with it. And now we've got to uh, rinse it out, which is uh, got a flush with 10 litres of cold water. So we've got to release the pressure on the cleaning bottle. Now we have to go and fill the bottle up with water and then flush it through. Now we take it full of water, connect the hose back up. Switch the pressure back on. bit boring we'll um, come back to it when I've finished it. So this is the last of 10 litres of fresh water to uh, just flush the tube out. And what I tend to do is I tend to take the tap off and uh, clean the tap as well because it gets yeast deposits in there. So uh, we'll come back to that. Let the pressure off of the uh, system. Just connect the uh, cleaner. Don't forget to let the pressure off the pipe. Or it should get wet. And then we'll take the force it off so that we can give it a clean. So we'll now go and clean. Right, this is uh, taking the tap apart. And uh, we find that uh, we get yeast build up in here. As you can see, it's on the spring.
make sure it's pushed right back so it's turned off. Then we need to remove the plastic cap. Be careful when you do this so you don't damage the uh, seal on the barrel. Then we have a little bit of uh, food grade grease that uh, I like to just pop a bit of that on. to leave that for a few hours to settle itself down because uh, we moved the keg about and that's it. Okay. 